Well. I'm getting used to talking to you guys because I'm gonna have to when I'm traveling. Um, I should probably give a bit of a lowdown on what's actually going on here. So basically, I'm going traveling for a couple of years and basically I got into this conversation with my mom and she was like, you're gonna have to text us every day. And I was like, no, that's not gonna be happening. So basically, me and my dad came up with this idea that I would post YouTube videos once a week while I'm away so that she knows that I'm not dead basically and that she's like all everything that I do she can like catch up on online now obviously I'm not going to be able to record everything because I literally have never YouTube before I was always into photography like even when I was in school and stuff I was like mad into photography but like never videography so it's going to be a bit of a game changer for me but I feel like it will keep her sane while I'm away and it'll also give me something to do because it's my first time being unemployed for like 10 years and I'm not used to this whole idea that like I don't have something to be doing or something to be studying for like I've been studying every year of my life since I started school because I kept going back and doing masters so it's definitely going to be a good experience for me I might hate it but everything that I love and hate I will document as I said this is a cheap up for my mother but I was like I may as well make it public like um, show other people what it's like to go traveling on their own I even though I have all these plans I have a thesis due on Saturday for my masters um, and I mean all this traveling is subject to me passing that because um, I was half thinking of going to New Zealand um, and if I don't pass the masters I obviously can't go to New Zealand because then I don't have a job um, so yeah I mean I still want to finish on a high um, also can you see that I'm a traveler budget saving to go away I'm literally just saving going to pass some minutes and Pasta sauce. Um, I think that it's alright. Like, sorry, our washing machine is going through an absolute fit at the moment. It's coming up with all these errors, and I'm going to try to empty it. Two seconds. Don't know if anyone has one of these dishwashers, but no idea. Like, I literally set it to empty. Like, all it's supposed to do is empty the fucking dishwasher or the washing machine. Um. Maybe that'll work. We shall see, we shall see. Anyway, yeah, so basically plan of action is to go into college, put down an absolute zig of study, and I'm actually gonna meet one of the girls for like a hot chicken roll and a coffee just to get into the zone. Oh, shit, I'm actually leaving. My lunchbox is out in the car, two seconds. The lunchbox has been retrieved. Um. So yeah, that's the plan anyway for the day. Um, I feel like I can't go to the library now anymore. Shout out to my friend Grania. Grania, if you're watching this, I love you. Um, literally the only reason I'm able to go into UCD now is because I just look forward to our coffee dates. And then whenever I text her, I'm like, are you in? And she's like, no. I'm like, okay, I'm going home. <laughs> I'm not staying here without you. Um, and I'm going to give you a tour of the gaff because... I am not staying here any longer than I have to. I'm moving out this week. I feel like any of the footage that you have seen from my bedroom in this gap has been me crying. Um, either by myself or watching YouTube videos. So shout out to the gaff for the emotional content. Um, I have to go and study. So, cue study montage. <laughs> 